Welcome to the ECDL Word Processing Module, section 1.2.1. Here we're asked to set basic options and preferences in the application, such as changing the username and the default folder to open and save documents. So if we open up Microsoft Word and we head to the File Options menu, that's right at the bottom of that list there, uh, there are two things that you need to know about. First, then, is how to change the username. Now, when this Word Options panel first opens, you'll be in the General section. You can see there are several sections down here. Uh, up in General, this is where you can change the username. Here in the middle, it says Username. And this is the name of the person who um, will be creating the document, uh, and their name will be listed in the properties of that document, wherever it's sent, wherever it goes, whatever happens to it in future. So if you're working for a business, for example, um, rather than using your own personal name, you might often need to uh, put the business name in here so that when that document goes off and it's used, even if you leave the business in future, that document uh, will still have the business name associated with it rather than your personal name, which could be um, confusing. So changing the username is as simple as deleting whatever is in there and typing in whatever name it is that you're given. So that's changing the username, simple enough. Uh, changing the default folder where uh, documents are saved or where Word looks if you're opening a document um, is also fairly simple, but let's just see what we mean by this first of all. I have a document here I haven't saved. If I go to the File Save panel here, and I just simply click on Browse. By default, uh, Word opens up uh, my Documents folder. So that is the folder it decides to look in to begin with. I can change it, I can go where I want, but that's the folder it will default to. Uh, if I was to open, and if I go to Open and I click on Computer and Browse, again, by default, it will look in this Documents folder. And I can change that. I can change which folder it looks in by default, uh, whether I'm opening or saving a document. So let's look at how we do that then. So again, we're in this Options panel, so File Options. And this time, we come down to the Save section. So we click on Save. And again, in the middle, you'll see this option here, Default Local File Location. So we can change this folder uh, if we want to. At the moment, you see it's going to C Drive, Users folder, and ECDL is the name of the user account on this computer, and then Documents, the Documents folder. Simply by clicking on Browse, we can decide where by default we will uh, save work. So let's click on Desktop. So instead of going to the Documents folder here, it'll go to the Desktop by default, and we'll click OK and click OK again. Now I still haven't saved this document so uh, Word doesn't uh, know where this is going to go. Let's go straight up to the file menu and click on Save. And now if we click on Browse, by default you'll see now it's looking at the desktop instead. I've changed that default file location and so now it's automatically looking to save my files to the desktop. And similarly if I click on Open and click on computer and then browse. Again, by default, it's now looking at the desktop. So both of those two options then in the options panel, changing the username, which is in the general section, and changing the default file location, which is in the save section, and simply click on the browse button.